Good morning to you. Time now, 643. Time for the uh, hair day forecast. We're going to have a two out of five out there today. It's going to be a pretty lousy hair day. Scattered showers off and on throughout the day today. Windy and humid as well. So keep that in mind as you get ready for work. I might just want to throw a hat on today or put your hair in a ponytail because a lot of rain out there. Here's a look at your Titan radar. A batch of rain is about to head into the heart of the PD this morning. Rain's on the increase in Darlington. That's headed east-northeast into the Florence area. If you live in Marlboro County, you're going to get some rain in a little while as well. Here's a close-up look at Darlington County this morning. That heavier rain, most of it in Chesterfield County. So if you're watching in Sherraw this morning, that rain's about to head in. Hartsville uh, over toward Darlington. Looks like it's raining pretty heavily in Darlington. And that's going to be headed into uh, northern parts of Florence here in a little while. East of I-95 in the PD, some light rain, but really not a whole lot to worry about. And our rain on the Grand Strand has pretty much ended for the time being. Let's go back to uh, our maps this morning and show you lower 70s around the area from our storm trackers. These are summer-like temperatures, and that's because it's so humid out there. A tropical air mass is in place, and with a cold front moving into that tropical air, we're going to have a pretty good chance of rain out there until the front moves through, and that's going to take until around the mid-evening hours tonight. It will be a warm day out there, mostly cloudy, 78 or 79, off and on rain, just periods of rain. You may have a few hours at a time where it doesn't rain at all, and that's when we'll get pretty warm out there today with highs in the low 80s. Looking ahead to Halloween, behind the cold front, we have some chilly air coming in for the Halloween weekend. In fact, Friday night, we could fall into the 30s for the first time this season across the PD, and that'll be our coldest air of the season so far. There's a look at the temperatures ahead of and behind the front. We have 70 in Atlanta, but not so far away in Little Rock, Arkansas. Temperatures are in the mid-50s, although our coolest weather is going to take until tomorrow to build into the area. So uh, we do have changes on the way. Here's your future track forecast today. A windy and warm day, off and on showers and thunderstorms. As we head into tonight, here comes your cold front. It's uh, warm on the south end of it, cooling off on the north end. And until that front is off the coast, I'm going to have to keep rain in the forecast. And it looks like that front will move through during those evening hours tonight. Windy and a whole lot cooler by tomorrow. It's not going to be cool today. High temperature near 81 in Florence, about 83 in Lumberton, and lower 80s at the beach as well. We'll keep that chance of rain and thunderstorms in the forecast through around 8, 9, 10 o'clock tonight. So keep that in mind as you make your evening plans. And then we'll cool off a little bit tonight with lows in the low to mid-50s. But look what happens headed into the weekend. Your seven-day forecast showing highs tomorrow at the beach with plenty of sunshine and windy conditions in the mid to upper 60s, all the way down to 41 on Friday night. The inland forecast, there could be some areas that have your first frost on Saturday morning. We'll keep an eye on that down to 38. Very cold for football Friday night. Well, it's almost 647, and it is color of the weather time. Daisy Lopez from J.C. Lynch Elementary is our artist of the day. Got right. some rain falling, maybe, but also some leaves falling. That's right. right. Looks like fall. Very pretty. Lots of nice colors. Mm -hmm. And it We're, looks like markers. Should probably use markers yeah, here. Yeah, we don't get a lot of marker pictures anymore. No, but this is very nice. Good did old watercolors. Yeah, did a great job, Daisy. Thank you very much. And kids, we need more pictures, so please send them on in to 101 McDonald Court in Myrtle Beach or P.O. Box 100528 in Florence.